Perfect. Drive my new car! I got a tear in my eye as well. Have you? Yeah. Oh. Well, morning, first of all, again, it feels like the third, well, it is the third time we said morning in this particular scenario. You've seen the collection video, the spec video, maybe, if you haven't, links will be around and down below. What's about to happen is I am about to drive my brand new Lotus Exige Sport 380 for the first time. If you want more information, go see those other two videos I filmed for you in the last couple of hours, basically. And now it is finally the time I have the key in my pocket to have my first drive. Now before you guys uh, ask me questions and stuff, like, and stuff like that, let me just explain that this car is not actually registered or insured yet. So we are driving on private ground and on track. Basically I am registering the car in Switzerland because uh, that is where I spend a lot of my time off camera and it made the most sense for me to register it there. So this car is gonna leave from here, go get PPF. Archie will be filming that and he's around here somewhere. I'm sure you'll see him during the video. But this guy's gonna get PPF and then be sent down to Geneva on a truck where I will then pick it up. Yeah, that's the current situation. So I can drive it. The first drive is going to be on track here. And I know you're gonna say don't drive your car hard on track. I'm not gonna drive it hard at all because it's not run in yet. I need to do about a thousand miles or so. So I'm gonna drive it really steady, but it's just to get the experience of driving it for the first time. And I thought we'd do it here. I'm gonna hop in, I'm gonna be by myself, GoPro set up. We're gonna head out to the track now. And you're gonna be filming from the back of this full. Oh yeah. I'm excited. Shall we just go ahead and Let's go, go for, it? for it? Let's do it. We're actually gonna get some of the guys who worked on the car and eventually the CEO of Lotus as well to sign a part of the car right just under this which is probably access panel which we we've spoken about and you'll see more in the spec video we're just going to lift that up some of the guys are going to come in and we're going to sign it now Perfect. so there, we, there go. we go the car has been signed there's one signature left but that will happen at another time uh, I think it looks really cool it goes well with the gold. Yeah. It's just a nice touch to have. It'll be that little party trick that I can just whip out <laughs> at any time. <laughs> Let's do this. First drive. First drive. Here we go. So you started it up in another video. Yeah. Second startup. This is the first actual startup where I'm going to be driving the car. Oh! I'm so excited. Okay. I'll see you guys in a bit. Just you and me now, boys. I think I have to. I don't know if you can hear that, but that makes a pretty significant difference. I have to open the valve. So look, if I switch it off, much quieter. Exhaust open, first gear. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I can't believe this is the first time I'm driving this. Oh, it just feels amazing. These seats are so lovely and having everything with the gold. What is life right now? I can't believe this is happening. Okay, here we go. <gasps> oh, first few meters. Do not knock it on the windows on your way out, Seb. Oh my God, we're outside. What is happening right now? Oh, it's so nice. <laughs> very slowly, very slowly indeed. It just feels, it's actually surprisingly smooth. I'm in normal mode obviously right now, touring mode. This is surprisingly comfortable. First, first gear change. Oh, that gearbox. I was so happy I went for the manual. I cannot believe how cool this feels. I genuinely feel like I'm in a dream. This can't be real, this can't be my car. Fruity, I hope you guys can hear it. What do I say? What do I say in a situation like this? We're going on track. There's Archie's car over there. Success 15 to base. It's amazing! It's literally just paradise. Uh, I've never been more nervous driving a car. Don't stall, don't stall, don't stall. Okay, we're through. Second. Oh, you sex bomb. I don't even know 
what to say to you guys. I mean, it feels just unbelievable. I am accelerating about this much. I do not want to push this car at all. Let's see what it's like with the valves closed and window, windows up. Oh, how relaxed is that? You can just cruise around in this. I don't want to go too fast also because no PPF. Let's put the valve back on. steering wheel so they just literally just told me that this is a one-off having this steering wheel no other exige 380 has it I can't see them where are they no oh, they're right there no other exige let alone 380 has this steering wheel so to be able to have it full Alcantara is something I really really wanted and is unbelievable Spec-wise, I could not be happier. The leather, but this Alcantara sting wheel and this gearbox, it's just the best mix. I'm so, I mean, again, this is very subjective to my taste, so maybe you guys won't agree that this is the perfect car, the perfect spec, all this stuff, but for me, I've been dreaming, guys, since I was probably eight years old. One day I want a car like this I mean maybe it's not a Zonda maybe it but right now for me this is one of my dream cars this is just unbelievable I mean it's like I never thought I would see this happen let alone so quickly and uh, it's just it's just so special I mean I can't accelerate because I need to uh, break in the engine, I need to break in the brakes, I need to break in the gearbox. So I can't do any acceleration with this gearbox, guys. Even just at slow cruising speeds like this is just surreal. There we go. Stopped for the first time. My first drive in my new car. This is unbelievable. This is, uh, this is what I've always dreamed of. Thank you. Thank you and thank everyone who's been involved. Uh, there's just literally, there's nothing I would change about it. And that's how you should feel when you order a car like this. If you guys, if you guys ever have a car that you can order from the factory, just do it. Because honestly, being able to have a car specced the way you want it, is just an experience that I don't think anything could replicate. I mean, it is unbelievable. Things like the carbon here, the stitching, the Alcantara, the seats, the gearbox, the steering wheel, the leather. Ah, it, oh, it's just what I've always, always dreamed of having, and it's it, it's uh, it's an emotional feeling. It's an emotional day, and it's something that I feel so incredibly fortunate to be able to share with people, other than just you know experiencing this by myself. To be able to bring you guys on this ride and to be able to have an experience like this and show you guys and hopefully you hopefully you know it's transpired to you some of the I know I'm just rambling but hopefully some of my excitement and some of just the wowness will have transpired to you guys because um this is this is literally a dream come true guys um I'm going to get out now and we're going to do a few drone shots and stuff like that but I could not could not have wished for a better day this has got to be one of if not the best day of my life and um, yeah I'm gonna stop rambling just thank you the presence I have just been rambling on so much on these GoPros but I mean this is this is unbelievable <laughs> I have apparently Archie was telling me it looks really different now. In the it looks light. completely different. It's changed colour. Wait, let me close my window and then I'm gonna come out and see because I've just been rambling so much to this GoPro. I don't even know if this video is gonna make sense. I'm just too <laughs> excited. <laughs> 
Oh, that's cool when you get out. Oh, yeah. Oh. It looks different, doesn't it? Oh, yes. What do you think? I don't even know what to say. Literally don't know what to say. This is unbelievable. I'm the happiest man alive right now. Yeah. I got a tear in my eye as well. Have you? Yeah. Oh. It looks absolutely spectacular and the colour yeah. just keeps changing so much. It's everything I wished for and I couldn't wish for any more. Good. Uh, this is, this is, I wouldn't change anything about this right now. I wouldn't change no. anything about today as a day. I wouldn't change anything about the car, the people around. It's just been, it's been perfect. So I'm just going to do one last little lap now and then we're good to go. I get out. I don't really know what we're doing, but they just told me, Seb, would you like to do one more lap? I was like, yes, yes, that is something I would like. I think we're doing a photos lap now. So I figured, why not bring you guys along? It feels so responsive. There's nothing I would rather be doing right now than to be driving this car. Everything around you just gives you a little, so like, if I look at the wing mirror, I can get a snippet of the gold, but then I've got the gold struts from the wing. Uh, in the back and all the carbon in front of me, I have carbon and these beautiful copper, fire, red, sills, oh, it's just, oh. I mean, yeah, there's nothing I can say. There is something, you see the slow gear change is so special, because I know I had the Elise, but this is just such a big step up for me. I mean, both financially and power-wise and all of that stuff, it's just taking things to the next level. So, I mean, oh, and it does these, these little crackles. Oh, okay, first acceleration. First proper acceleration. First proper braking. It, it breaks. It breaks well. This is is my baby. This is something that I designed. Oh, one more acceleration. Wow. I'm, I'm losing track completely, guys. Uh, the, it's my baby. I was saying I've developed, well, developed it. I've specced it so it feels completely like, like my car. If you are a petrol head, who's taken delivery of one of your dream cars in your dream spec, you know what I'm feeling right now. Um, this is my first brand new car. It's uh, my first spec car, obviously, for that. Some people say it's a supercar, some people don't. I consider this a supercar. Clearly very biased, though. This is not a funny joking around video. This has got to be one of my most honest videos I think I've ever done. This is literally... You know, me just doing this. Some people think that I could have done this ages ago. I couldn't. This is uh, something I've genuinely been working for and um, something special. I don't even know if what I'm saying is making sense, but I'm obviously very, I'm very, very sad that uh, I can't drive this out of here today, but there's nothing I can do. That's just the way it works sometimes with registering your car. Um, this I've paid for it. The car's mine. I can do whatever I want with it. I just legally can't drive it on the road, so it has to be track stuff. But you know what? It's not too bad in terms of having to uh, having to bed it in and, and get used to the car. So yeah, I mean, guys, this has been my first drive in my brand new Lotus Six Sport 380. I think I'm just going to switch the cameras off now. We're going back in. I'm going to just drive it to where we're parking it. And I'm going to enjoy the car. Uh, yeah. Yeah, thank you again. I know I keep saying it, but honestly. I will uh, be doing plenty of videos of this. The next video will be putting it onto a truck in order to uh, bring it to wrap style. To get wrapped, to get PPF'd. But I think I might as well end the video now. Thank you so much for watching as per usual, guys. Please remember to subscribe if you aren't already. And I'll see you soon. Thanks. Bye. Quick cap saying, Saturday in the mouth. Snow Julia.